Uh, here did it go. Hey there, everyone. This is Wow Cow playing some MKM. Some Mushroom Kingdom meltdown. Let's go. Last time we managed to go through World One, surprisingly. And uh, I guess we're now ready to go on to the little, really, very floral and uh, happy tree-filled mountain. Something. World Two. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Kind of breathless for some reason there. Okay. Okay. So he'll kill some of my minions. That's pretty sad. I guess he's gonna kill some Yoshi's or something. Whoa, okay, so, mountain setting, there's rocks, there's Koopas, there's Hoppin, lots of colors though, so we're free, and there's a yellow platform there, and there's a guy, you just kind of fall, he would have fell on me, if it wasn't for me, okay, and I see that we're already depending on the glory and homogeneousness of mushrooms to get by. Slow down, that's nothing new. Okay, so I guess we're in the little platform stage, whoa, boomerang guy, you're blue, why are you blue, boomerang guy? That is not your usual color. That platform there was weird. Lilo, I love, I love. I am very good at noticing things that are in front of me. Whoa, there's a sound when you throw a fire, a fireball, a boomerang. Boomerangs are Australia's fireball. Everyone knows that. Now, come on, I'm not teaching anyone anything here. Oh yeah, it's a red level, so I got me on the left out for the redness of the Oh no, it's a shaky bridge! It's gonna fall apart, is it? Hey! Yes, it is. Ah! Okay. <laughs> um. Never trust bridges. It's kind of unfortunate because in real life they're pretty useful. They are the very basis of civilization. But ever since the advent of video games, they've been like being reduced to secondhand citizens. I guess maybe that's why people are against video games sometimes. Why people blame video games for you know the destruction of human culture. Don't talk about human cuisine though, because bridges and video games and cuisine rarely, very rarely match. Gamers are not that well known for their uh, fancy taste. So I'm just gonna run on this bridge and hope that I don't die! Whoa! Oh my much No! <laughs> that boomerang! It turned around! Oh, hello there, Mr. Ball. There's a bridge over there. Isn't that great? It's kind of weird. It's like, well, oh no, we build this bridge, but but we fail to realize that the other end of the ravine, about three foot over there, it's not high enough. We're not gonna make it like slanted or anything. We'll just let it suspend there. Oh man, there's lots of uh, lots of red going on. Balloopaloo! Whoops! I just fell there. Oh, uh, the yellow blocks are actually a. <laughs> Someone dropped their key, and they're apparently 20 kilometers tall. It's kind of surprised I managed to not notice them until now. Mountain secret. Oh, the secret of the mountain. We'll learn how to make maps and forest for fire. Oh, it's that music. Geno's Wood and Nalbatas just kind of chilling around with its very nice flying animation. Okay, and he just kind of bopped on his head. Something over there, over there, it's a life! Oh boy! Man, you gotta love your life. So, mountain setting secret, the secret of mountain, no, it's just a mountain secret, it's not a mountain setting secret. Why is it called mountain sitting? Is there something I'm not getting? Where does my gonna fall? I don't know, there's a, there's a bridge, but we don't care. Well, it's impossible not to sing along to Geno's Wood. Mountain maze, forest vista, I don't know how it's called. Anyways, there's stuff here, so I gotta watch out. Hey there, bird man. Hey there, bird guy. Birds! In the way! But because you cannot trust bridge in this modern day and age, I do not know how to react. Can you burn a bird? Yes, you can burn a bird. Oh, and there's a pipe there. Can you burn a pipe? No, that I very much doubt. Also, flying just kind of no chilling floating land mass here. Makes ja! About no sense. Uh, ee! <laughs> I'm gonna die soon, <laughs> okay. I'm, kind of, I'm, I'm happy I did not die soon after all. Mm, though I will not lie when I say that I think you need, you're supposed to use this to go there. Or is it? No, that's probably it. Yeah! Inside, Mario guy. Oh, maybe not. Okay, yeah, because I'm hearing the distinct thump. 
of a head hitting uh, cartilage. Lots of cartilage in the pipes. That's why the fishing industry is so booming, basically. You need a lot of fish to make some pipes. Yay! Well, that was exciting. <laughs> Let's do it again! <laughs> oh, that's kind of silly. So I take it the trampoline is to get up here I guess? Well, I guess so, Mr. Landmark. It's not a good name. There's lots of birds here, and birds are frightening. Oh, and the pipe there's probably to get you back to where there's a trampoline. Okay, well, that makes sense, I suppose. Whoa! Okay, and it just plops you out right on the ball. Well, th that's not very considerate, but I will take what I can when going on a road trip. You want to bring your snake, you want to bring your possum, and you want to bring your green switch palace. That is not unnecessarily bolded. What? Uh, well, at least time reset. What? Ah! what is going on now? What? What? What is going on now? I don't like this. I'm now in space. Um. Uh. What am I doing in space? <laughs> Um, oh, hi there, guy. Um, what's going on here? Ah! Oh, no, I'm in space! Wow, that little slimy guy just got a... Whoa, there's wind or something, or maybe the cycle... No, okay. I'm... Midpoint! Look at that! I got a midpoint here. Isn't that awesome? It was invisible. I am not redoing that maze. <laughs> Yeah, I think there is win. I'm not too sure. Feels weird. Okay. Oh, wow, that was a worthwhile mushroom. Ugh. This is not going very good. Okay. I don't know if it's... Also, how'd you get that super background speed going without doing it on the platform? Well, anyways. Okay. E yeah. Okay, gotta be careful. Gotta be careful. There, in space, there's a lot of mutant potatoes. No, that hang around. Why do I keep falling off? Why do I keep falling off? Stop falling off all the time. Also, try and make your jump all the time. You know, instead of falling all the time, make your jump all the time. It would be a lot more constitutionalized. Okay, gotta be careful. Yeah, okay, now I'm, I'm big. That's good. Being big is good. You know, you get more responsibilities, you get more respect, you can get more done, you get the vote. Voting's pretty awesome. You get to see an old man, punch him in the face. That's how you vote. If it's on your left, you vote for a guy. If it's with your right, it's with another. If, if that was the case, there wouldn't be any voting problems. Anyways, when science, you can't jump on that. Going down the spike here. There's gonna be two swamps. Swamp, 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 swamp. Hello there, guy. How is it going today? How do you like your punch? I like with a lot of whipped cream. It's kinda gross, but you didn't ask if it was something that I would actually enjoy to eat or just something to eat maybe on a dare, you see? So, now we got space wood and space little electricity men. Mm, that, that was it. It's pretty great. Another mushroom for me to kinda eat. Yeah, 
I love their little squishy animation though, it's like so simple, it's just like a line. But it works so well! The world just doesn't want to end here. Okay, so Swamp Man. Oh, and I get hit by the bullet. That's kind of uh kind of humiliating. Ah! What? What? Uh, uh Wait. What? I was in the future? I, I was in the <laughs> I have no idea what's going on! Oh! I had a preview of how it's gonna be in the space age. Swamps will be identical to how they are now. Who would have thought? The world is in pain. Can you save the president from a burrito inflection? I honestly doubt it. <laughs>